What's up guys and welcome to Boyd. This is an RTS strategy game coming out on Steam on January 8th and I'm going to be doing some gameplays of it just for fun because I really do enjoy the game. I'm going to be playing with bots sometime later in the early access. They will have a single player campaign but they only have these bot games which I actually really enjoy. They're going to be starting probably two levels at a time for a little bit and be doing them on easy mode. I might do the uh, harder modes later but this is a mini series. If you don't know what that is, basically I will be playing for as long as I want. If this one episode is it, then that's it. If two episodes is it, then that's it. But basically, the support given to the series will help me determine if I should continue the series after this first episode. So if you enjoy the series, make sure to give it a like, comment in the comment section below, all that kind of stuff. But basically, it's an RTS game. So we have an underwater sort of thing here, and we have all these little amoebas that we can send to attack like this. And we're actually battling against an the enemy. There's a guy over here doing the same exact thing, and we sort of want to take over these little bubbles and that'll help uh oh guys no attack these guys not those there we go <laughs> we should be able to take this over and that'll be really helpful there we go and once we take one of these over they will start building an army here the bad thing here is it looks like these guys are taking out this and i really hope they don't take it but yeah it's a really cool game and we also have like if we send our little base amoebas here they will take over this and they will eventually turn into it they made my job easy here by killing off some of them, but they also ran away because they were too low on health. Since we outnumber them now, we can take it out. And this is a, actually, what is it? What are these guys again? Hmm, I think they are, like sometimes you can double click it and it'll show you what it is. There it goes, a gun, attacks from a distance, which is really good. Now we got a big group of guys over here. We're gonna send them over here, which is a, a crab, a powerful but slow. So there we go, we have a lot of underwater type things. These guys are gonna run over, but they're not gonna mess with us right now because we're sort of pretty strong. We're gonna get more guns and then more crabs. This is gonna be a pretty easy setup right now just because, you know, it's early in the game, it's on easy mode. Let's turn these guys into guns. This way we can ambush these guys from a distance. They're actually all gonna run away. Oh, no, they're turning around, okay. That's fine, that's fine. And while this is all happening, I'm gonna keep on making more guns and crabs. Send these guys out this way. They're gonna be big and strong. We gotta make sure that our areas are defended because if these red guys roll over to our gun base while there's nobody there, they automatically get it. There's no fight. There's no capture. It's just immediately they get it. So we need to make sure our bases are covered. And it looks like they're actually uh, stocking up over here, which is a bad thing. So we wanna get more people over here. The good thing about a gun base is that since they attack from a distance, it's really, really easy to uh, defend with them. All right, so the, these guys are gonna try to take our crab base, but that's definitely not gonna be enough. We're gonna go over here and take out everybody over here. Now, they do have some guns, as you can see, but the guns aren't gonna be able to defend against this many crabs. So let's get all these guys and send them into attack. And that, that, way, that way we get another gun base, which will be cool. We got more guys flooding in this way, which is sort of scary. And what are these guys doing? They don't even know. <laughs> that's okay, that's okay. And ooh, we end up getting this. So now we can start defending really, really well here because we outnumber them like nuts. So let's defend our area here. And once we kill off this guy, let's go in for an attack. Now we also have a bunch of crabs, which we're actually going to send in probably to help out here because these guys are having quite the issue right now and make these guys into more crabs. So right now, so far so good. This guy's taking back our gun base though. That's a pain in the booty. You, yeah, you take this base and then we'll do the rest over here. But this guy's charging back. <laughs> it's a big mess right now, to be honest. But ooh, we fought back here, which is really, really great. All right, now we're gonna charge over here. And, and ooh, this is empty, that's perfect. So you can see here that the easy, easy bot really doesn't play too well. Also, if you guys really do enjoy this, I most definitely will try to play this online at some point because it does have online competitive stuff. This was once a mobile game, but it works so well as a PC game that I'm not complaining that it's a PC game now or once was a mobile game. I know some people are stingy with that kind of stuff, but I just like the game. All right, so what's going on over here? Okay, we did take that base, but they could at any point take it back, so we do have to be careful. And it looks like that's what they're in the process of doing. Let's send everybody over there. <laughs> Let's have a big old party. We've taken everything else. So if we're smart about this, we can have an all-out ambush. And this could be throwing the run. This could actually be saving it. Who knows? We're just gonna have an all-out ambush, though, and have everybody charge there. We can also zoom out. One thing I don't like about zooming out is you can't play like this. It would be super helpful if you could, but you cannot. And it sort of gets awkward. It's like, I want to click here to zoom in, but it still just zooms me in here because this is where my camera was last. And it can be sort of annoying like that. 
Oh well though, it still works great. It's not bad by any means, it's just how it is. And there we go, we finish, we get the victory. I did want to say that this is quite different than what I normally do here on the channel. I'm more of a platformer kind of person before we head into our next level of choke point. And because of that, I will probably not be doing much of games like this. So this is a rarity on my channel, and if you like this rarity, then you gotta make sure to show me the support in the comment section and the like bar and all that kind of stuff so that I know to keep doing this kind of stuff. But it's all up to you guys, of course. Thank you guys all for your support. It really is appreciated. All right, we're gonna immediately go to this base just so we can get more people generating in. Now, we should be able to win this fight pretty easy. There we go. And we're gonna wait for everything to stock up here because we just need a moment. And what we'll probably do is wait for this to turn into four people. There we go. Send it over here. And while they're making their trip over here, we'll get these guys all stocked up. Hopefully then we can get them all clustered up and go in for an ambush over here all at once, not wave by wave, and that'll be nice. There we go. All those guys getting in now. And they're the crabs, of course. So there we go. And now that we have that, we can sort of hopefully win this battle. There we go. Excellent. And now we can get these guys in here. Hopefully they win this fight. I'm really not sure how strong scouts are, if we're going to be able to win this fight or not. But the good thing is, is that scouts are very fast. They do what their name says. They can scout out an area very easily, very quickly, and that's super duper helpful. And we do end up getting that area, which is really, really awesome. I'm gonna turn a few more guys into crabs. Let's, uh, let's get this group of three. Send them over here to become scouts. These guys will be our dedicated crabs, so that'll be good. And we're gonna get a few of the uh, scouts here, maybe like you. Let's just get one of them here and send him over there so we know what's going on in this area. It looks like we do have some type of battle going on here. Some of the normal amoebas are coming over this way. I see this what it's called, like amoebas, germs, something like that. I wanna call them germs, that just sounds fun to call them. All right, then it looks like we have an all out attack here, defending up that base. Let's go over here, take this over. Let's also have some defense, so let's set up this so that there's more crabs going through. We need our home to be nice and safe and everything else. Okay then, more crabs, or actually no, those are guns, which actually will be helpful. And But we got guys rolling in. Uh, let's do a bit of that. Excellent, okay, I'm really enjoying this. This is such a fun game in my opinion. Okay, oh no, they're taking that base back though. That's not good at all. We're gonna have to fight back then. Yeah, okay. We got a we got a bunch of guys now, though. Yeah, we're gonna leave that guy there. He can defend. Hmm. What are we gonna do here? Oh, man, I'm slipping up here really badly. Like, they, they aren't taking it with force, though. Like, they only have one guy here. We'll be able to take it back very, very easy. But the fact of the matter is we let it slip at all. And oh, gosh, what is what is happening here? This is ridiculous. I'm doing so bad because this is like, I thought I had this covered, apparently I didn't. I need to pay a little more attention then. Let's get some more scouts up there just so we have them. And we got a bunch of gunners now, so let's go down here. And this still isn't taken. Whatever they're doing, they aren't doing it well because they don't really have anything besides some guns and some normal guys. I don't, yeah, this is definitely not taken. Okay. Hmm. Now we have plenty of scouts, so I'm gonna send these guys off to gun camp so they can learn all about how to be a gun. Send some of these guys off with the guns so that they also have some extra manpower. Okay, this is actually working out really well so far. I mean, of course, we did have a good number of slip-ups there. Get all these guys, send them off there, and get like half of these guys and send them off that way. We don't wanna, you know, leave ourselves our defenses open. That's never a good idea. And also they did take the gun or the crab for a moment, but that's not a big deal. Hmm. Yeah, they're, they're on their way to take most of it, and we should have a good stock up here. Let's do a bit of that, excellent, okay. So far, so good. Now everybody, let's have a party over this way. They're fighting for all that, that's okay though. Maybe have these guys turn on these guys, there you go. These scouts can be annoying, they don't deal much damage at all. Okay, now it's a battle for this area. <laughs> all right, I feel like at this point, we should probably have like a big stack up. There we go, get all these guys, plump them in there too. And wow, that actually, that charge didn't work. Okay, so it's just sort of a matter of deciding what to do. I think I'm gonna get this whole big party here and send it in. Yeah. <laughs> Is that the best idea in the world? Probably not, but that's not what my plan's about. It's about having fun, not good ideas. <laughs> 
be a mini series, which is what this is. It's more dependent on what I feel like playing and how long I feel like playing it. It can be a game that should take 50 episodes to complete, but that doesn't matter because the goal isn't to complete it. It's just to sort of have fun with the game for as long as I want or as long as you guys want. If you guys want 50 episodes, then great. If you guys want one episode, then great. But um, that's what this series is all about, or mini series, that idea is all about. And you'll be seeing more and more of this throughout 2015. I think it'll greatly up the variety of the channel, which will make it a better channel in general. And if you want to see some maybe some newer games coming out that you would like to see a mini series on, feel free to let me know. Because I can't, I simply can't do a full let's play of every game. That would be rather difficult. All right, we're gonna have these guys stick here, and then these guys go in. Yeah, you guys defend the base. You take out those guns. But these guys are most definitely taking out this base. And this will be a big brawl, but that's fine. And that that whole big old grouping up idea really did work out. We're gonna try to do that again then. All right, there there we go. Excellent. You guys are going to fight off these guys. Have a good old fun party here. And we're gonna do the same thing over here. We got tons of crabs, tons of guns. Take him out over there, buddies. Alrighty then. And let's fight that guy off. He doesn't know what to do. He's like, I'm out of here. <laughs> I don't know what to do with myself. They're gonna fight him off, okay? Shoot him away. <laughs> Get him, boys! <laughs> Alrighty then. Let's make sure our defenses are covered, though. We do not want to leave this much stuff open. There we go. We are actually doing really fantastic here. So I'm happy about this. And this is, this is a big brawl. This is a really big brawl. Come on now. And uh, yeah, another guy's generated before they'll be able to get to there, which is a good thing. And look, we easily take that. Excellent. Keep some of these guys here so that we can keep protecting this. But the most most of the party is going to be charging in here. Okay, that should be good. And what's going on down here? We got this area nice and taken, which is a good thing. So it looks like we're going to take this. And now we just need to take one more, so everybody into the pile. <laughs> I love doing this so much. And these guys will be fighting there, so they're a little occupied. So I can even get these guys to have a bit of a sneak mission, but we got it. There's the full victory. Awesome. Let's head out now. But there we go. This is rather different for me. This is the first episode of Boyd. If you'd like to see more, you got to make sure you show me the support in the comments section below and the like. And all that kind of cool stuff. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. Once again, this is an early access game, so it is not complete. But I'll definitely be playing it more as it develops. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.